Ashley, and we're El Camino de Rio Robotics. Doing robotics is really different than you think it is at the beginning. Most people accept, expect it to be easy, but it's not. Things don't always work out like, like you want it to, but that's normal. When you ride a cove, does it walk every time? No, like, it doesn't work every time. No, it does not always work. Sometimes it glitches, it could have a bug, it could it could do anything. It could be like a surprise glitch in the middle of the code. How do you make your code walk? Uh, we, if it doesn't walk, how do you make it walk? If it doesn't work, we always, like, if it doesn't work the first time, we run it again and to see, like, what the problem is, and then uh, we either ask one of our teammates, or we ask, we either ask one of my, our teammates, or we ask another team, or else we ask Heidi if we can't, uh, find out like the first few times what the, what is wrong with the code and then robotics is a process you make small changes to your code to make it work better sometimes you have to start over with a totally new strategy but each time you run your code you learn something when it finally works it feels awesome Oh! I did it! Once you have your code that works, that's just the beginning. The robot, the robot doesn't always do the exact same thing. Each one is a little different. So you have to test it. We run our code at least 10 times and we collect data on its performance. How many times does it succeed out of 10? So what do all those checks mean? You have eight check marks. What does that mean? Uh, that means it ran perfectly eight times. Ooh, that's pretty good, isn't we it? We did it, yep, two other times perfectly, too. Okay. Hi. Hi. So this mission is going to try to um, go forwards, back up against the wall, and deliver this little well into this black circle. The robot isn't very accurate, so it will end up in a different place every time. The farther you go, the bigger error. We use the color sensor to identify when we cross this line. That tells us where we are lengthwise on the board. But we could be anywhere on this line. When we back up against the wall, that tells us where we are widthwise on the board. Now we know exactly where we are and we can deliver the well with accuracy. Our mission was to pick up the broken pipe and bring it back to the base. We attach an extra motor, motor with the arm to our robot to pick up the pipe. Use the light sensor to find the white line right next to the pipe. This tells us where the robot should turn. After we pick up the pipe, we brought it back to base. Success! What do you think is the most important thing you've learned this year? The most important thing I learned is this year to keep my team together instead of yelling at each other and arguing all the time. That's really important. Each year we go to the to a first Lego League tournament. Okay, here we go. In three, two, one, go! In competition, you get two and a half minutes to run your robot to score points. It can be really stressful, but also it's exciting. Favorite. My favorite 
part of robotics is programming because like I feel like it really suits me and it's really fun. This year we didn't win an award but we worked hard and learned a lot. We made our coaches really proud. If there was an award for this for the team that had the most energy and that had the most fun, we would have won the award for sure. Oh, um,